I remember that night like it was yesterday. I grabbed a whole bunch of black plastic bags, packed all of my things, and went to my best friend's house, Josh. What else could I do? I was 16, I didn't know how to do anything. My parents sheltered me completely from everything. I didn't know how to balance a checkbook and get a job and do all those things. And yeah, I was old enough to get a job at 16, but I didn't know how to do any of that because they didn't teach me. So they kind of just threw me out there. And they gave me an ultimatum and I, and I made my choice. I was kicked out of my home at 16 because I was caught with someone that I care about a lot. My sexuality is not accepted by my family at all because my parents are extremely religious, so it's, it's evil. Not only that, but in our culture, it's kind of taboo. It's the devil. It's demons. You have to rebuke it. If you don't change your ways, you're going to go to hell. These are the things that I've heard ever since they've, they've known it. And even before I verbally expressed my sexuality to my parents, you know, they would find little things and they would, they would ask me and I would lie because I was terrified. Even before I said anything about my sexuality, I was being called a faggot. Um, my cousins would be like, why are you so, such a pussy? Lo hispano somos bien machista. You know, well, not, not somo, pero son bien machita, los son, and especially Dominican men. If they find out that I'm gay, you know, what's gonna happen? And of course, I found out at 16 what, what happened, you know? <laughs> so I had every right to be terrified. After two years, I returned home and told them that I wanted to change. Mom, I wanna change. I don't wanna be gay anymore. I wanna come home. I gave up. I couldn't change how I felt, and that's when I realized that I was just lying to myself and I was lying to everyone else. And who wants to live a lie? So I finally just said, screw it, I can't do it anymore. I'm not gonna keep pretending, I'm gonna just be myself. And they couldn't take that, so I had to leave again. And now it's basically just, I'm completely cut off.